Your name, please. Michael McIntyre. And I'm Stuart Brodian. And Mr. McIntyre, this is an interesting music instrument. Can you please tell us what this is? Absolutely. This is a cigar box guitar, and I made it in three days, and I modeled it after my Martin, my little mini backpack and Martin. Okay. And uh, I made the frets out of nails, and I filed them down and so they fit, you know, and I measured it all up so it's exactly like a, a scaled guitar. And uh, my, my end of my bridge here, I made, it's just a handle from Home Depot. You know, they already had the, the four holes in, so I was like, that's the one, and I got it. And this uh, sound resonator is yes. a drain. A drain? A drain, yeah, it's for macroids up the street. And uh, it's electric, too. I hooked in uh, two piezoacoustic re- uh, sound pickups in here, and it, you know, it has the bridge, and it has the... The, the neck and the bridge, and it's all it all works. It sounds cool. And uh, these, this is probably the most expensive part was the tuners, and everything else. The neck was all hand carved. Let's see the back of the neck here. Yeah. What, what size piece of wood did you use? I used a one and a half by one and a half, uh, you know, pole. And uh, it plays good. Is this tune guitar tuning, or is this tune ukulele tuning? It's or is... uh, my own tuning. Oh, your own tuning? Yeah, the own tuning. It's uh, C, F, A, and uh, C again. And it makes a nice chord. <laughs> it's a little out of tune right now, but it stays okay. in tune pretty well. Where did you get the box? I got the box over at the cigar shop in downtown Bethlehem. And they were, they were selling them for cheap. And I picked up a bunch of them, and then I saw this box, and I and I liked it, you know, to, for my first one. It looked perfect. Excellent. And uh, this little piece is just like a little frame, you know, for uh, for picture frames. You put them on the end, and I thought it would look nice. You know, it all ma- it matches everything. It matches the color. Twenty big rich. <laughs> Don't forget that. It's pretty cool. I keep the sticker on it. Sure. Your character. <laughs> of course. Yeah. And, I like this. It gives it a touch of class. Yeah. Yeah. And it's like, you know, it, it kind of gives you that area, like, where's the metal part, you know? And I don't know, it kind of directs me to that. And has artistic talent as well. Yeah. Thank you. Sure. One last question. Uh, if, if people were to contact you, would you, would you make them on um, demand? I would. Yes, I would. I would make them... Anybody, I can make them. If you want a bigger scale, I can make a bigger scale. You got an email address? Uh, yes, I do. It's at darklydreamingmike at gmail.com. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.